x squared minus 13x plus 5. First of all, we look at the 6 and the 5, which I highlighted in blue. Those we multiply. 6 times 5 is 30. Now we're going to find all the factors of 30. So 1 times 30 is 30. By the way, they have to add up to be a negative 13. So we want to use a negative 1 and a negative 30. So after 1 comes what? 2. 2 times what is 30? 2 times 15. Then after 1, 2. After 1 and 2 comes what? A 3 times 10 will be 30. 4 does not go into 30. So 1, 2, 3, 4. Forget 4 and move on to 5. 5 times 6 is 30. And that's all of the factors of 30. Every last factor. Now we have to find the factors that add up to be a negative 13. That's our middle member up there. 6x squared minus 13x plus 5. So we want to have a minus 13. So I highlighted that in blue. We want to use the negative 3 and the negative 10. Now this is the no fuss method. We're going to start off saying 6x and 6x. That gets written twice. This is, a, this is a different method. This is not the AC method. This is the no fuss method. You copy that 6, which is kind of an orange color. You put it down twice. And then I use my negative 3 and my negative 10, which were in blue. Out of the left factor, I factor out a 3. And that's 3 times 2x and 3 times negative 1. Out of the right member, I factor out a 2. And that's 2 times 3x and 2 times 5. Then I throw away the 3 and the 2 and I'm left with my two final factors.